here we have what we call a grounding rod in case the solar panels get struck by lightning it will find a grounding post to the ground instead of into our components so I'm gonna pound this boy all the way down until there's about you know six inches enough to put a rod clamp on to wire the um, we're using four gauge um, grounding copper bear copper there we go there you have it and then we'll put a little clamp on it about right here run the wire out so far so good it's coming together this piece here is a grounding clamp rod, rod clamp so you can slip it up over the top screw it down until it's tight here and uh, attach your wire to that top area and you're set. Alright, I'm running the ground. Drill a small hole. So I'll be going out there. I'm going to continue feeding my grounding wire outside until I have enough to run it. Once I have it grounded outside, I'm going to clamp it underneath this thing and just squash it down so it doesn't go anywhere. And then it's going to be wired through this port and then into the box. Right. Looks good. Our ground is secured to the neutral bonding block out the side here, wrapped it up around back, ran it down, fastened it down here, outside. There we go. We have our grounding wire. gauge I'm gonna run it right along the side of the house and down here 